Good day, David here, and welcome to another Evolution of Everything video. When a Mars-sized object collided with Earth 4.5 billion years ago, it knocked off a chunk that would become the Moon. It also tilted Earth sideways a bit, so that our planet now orbits the Sun on a slant of 23.5 degrees. Those were two huge changes, but what would it be like if this never happened and Earth was never tilted? Now, over the course of the year, the amount of sunlight striking the northern and southern hemisphere varies as they wobble back and forth. First, the southern hemisphere leans sunward, then the northern hemisphere. This cycle drives Earth's seasonal variation. So, without the Earth's tilt, humanity would be in a sorry state as there wouldn't be seasons as we know them today. Forget modern technology, the steam engine, or sliced bread. In a world without seasons, there wouldn't even be wheat. Humans would probably never have advanced past a state of living in small, scattered settlements, scourging for its survival and often dying of horrific insect-borne diseases. Scientists think that an Earth without a tilt would be stratified into climate bands that would get progressively colder as you moved away from the equator. Humans would never survive the continuous winter of the high latitudes, and so we would likely congregate in the planet's tropical midsection. Fortunately, as things are, Earth's tropical zone tends to have minimal temperature and day length variability over the course of the year, and so these regions can serve as archetypes of what a seasonless Earth might be like. Now, if the habitable world were a humid tropical zone like the rainforests of the Congo, unrelenting rainfall would quickly erode soil in any areas cleared for farming, and would leach nutrients down below root level, swiftly rending tilled land and fertile for crops. The result is that humans can only live with low population density supported by shifting agriculture, or something like it, in most of the humid lowland tropics. This results in low population density and low agricultural productivity which in turn results in small scattered settlements. The amenities of modern societies cannot be built on this foundation. On top of our problems with agriculture, humans would also be plagued by diseased pathogens, which thrive in warm humid environments. Winter protects much of the world's population from tropical insects which carry deadly diseases, HIV is one of the viruses that has escaped its tropical forest home. Many others, like the Ebola virus, are waiting for their chance. If on the other hand, Earth were unwaveringly warm and dry like the Arabian Peninsula, our species would be even worse off, or extinct. Aside from winter's role in stifling the growth of deadly pathogens and the insect carriers, winter has been vital for humans' development in many other ways. First off, wheat grows only where there are cool or cold winters. This is a vital invention that helps feed the world with other essential food crops, including corn, potatoes, oats and barley, which also grows better with a cold winter. Crops might not be the only thing that would be affected. The Industrial Revolution, and all the technology that sprung from it would also be affected. This is because they also have their roots in the existence of winter. In a way, modern technology can be thought as a byproduct of the development of new ways to keep warm. So there are many things that makes Earth the perfect planet to support life, and its tilt is certainly one of them. That's it for this Evolution of Everything video. Leave us a comment what you think life on Earth would be like without its seasons. Like this video if you liked it, and subscribe to our YouTube channel for more content like this one. And as always, we'll see you in the next video.